When you pick up a job with someone like Ricky Skaggs, how much instruction does he give you in your role in a band like Kentucky Thunder? When I was still a senior in high school, I got a call, and it was uh, Ricky's bass player, Mark, and said, I'd like you to try out. It never happened. Like, I never heard anything else. It was just bombed, you know? And a couple of years later, I got a call, like, we need somebody to go fill in for the weekend. It's like, oh, heck yeah, I'm all about it, you know? And so we went and did the three shows, and on the bus ride home, Ricky comes up to the front and says, all right, everybody, I've decided to hire Cody. Clay's leaving the band, and what do you guys think? But then he pulled me to the side, and he's like, man, your, your solos are going to be fine. He's like, but we really need to work on your rhythm. He specifically yeah. said that? Oh, man, he totally <laughs> did. And we sat down in his studio for an hour, and he said, here's just like 10 things that you need to do and just kind of uh, and get away from them. Back then, you know. To get away from that. Get away from that. How interesting. Yeah. He said, here's just some things that you need to do. And then from there on, you do your thing. You know, and he was always just, just very easy. 